Hey guys, welcome back. So for today's video, I'm going to show you how to get a look that will be perfect for Valentine's Day. So we're first starting with some Revolution Conceal and Define Concealer in C12 and I'm just buffing this all over my lids. And yeah, I think this is, will be the only Valentine's look I'm going to have on my channel, but I do have plenty already up that I've done previously, so I'll link some of those in the info box. Next, I'm using the new Nude Palette by Huda Beauty and grabbing this shade right here, and I'm going to really buff this into the outer corner, the crease area, and really like have it shape my eyes to look a little bit bigger, but I was so impressed by these shadows, like, I don't reach for this palette much but like when I used it this time I was really shocked by how pigmented the shades are and how nicely they blend you guys will see in a bit next I'm using this darker purple shade and I'm gonna buff this in underneath that first shade that we use not going completely all over it just underneath it and if you do want to bring the shadows higher up just use the previous color to bring the shadow up rather than a darker one you want to keep that dark one right in that inner corner bit but look at that blend now i'm using this super sparkly foil shade which is so stunning and i'm just going to pack this on my lid you can use your finger to kind of transition the two shades um, but honestly it just works so nice with a brush anyways i did actually wet the brush first with some setting spray and then i kind of use that to like make it more metallic and pop a bit more i'm also using the matte and metals one this is from her new range and the shade i'm using is called called froyo this is just to give an extra like pop of color and make it sparkle a bit more and i've been so obsessed with these matte and metals they're so good i'd really honestly like recommend them to anyone as such good quality but now I'm using the benefit roller liner in black and ever since I got this I've been so obsessed like it's just so easy to use like literally I'm not cutting this clip right now and I'm just gonna show you how easy I do a wing liner with it it's so good and it doesn't fade it's super black and I'm just really happy with it and yeah what do I say now I don't know <laughs> So when I'm done with that, I'm going to pop some mascara on. This is Maybelline Falsies Angels one. I don't know. I'll write it in the info box. But I'm also going to pop some eye lower lashes. And again, if I don't mention the names, I'll have everything written in the info box. And now I'm going to use some Superfruit Extract by Revolution Skincare. It's a primer and it smells so yum. Kind of tacky and it's really, really good, especially if you have dry skin. I'm going to take my Cover FX foundation, again I'm going to write the shade in the info box and I'm just going to buff this in properly. I think I'm G60, I might not, let me not say that, just go to the info box guys. <laughs> just pop some on my forehead, now I'm going to use some Cover FX Powerplay concealer, again another nice concealer but shade is a little bit more my skin tone and i'm going to use some ex1 Gleep fluid concealer in eight just to make it a bit more my shade and then when i'm done with that i'm going to grab my real techniques highlight brush i think or setting brush no this is the setting brush i'm just going to blend that this brush is so good for like blending your concealer so I definitely recommend it to you guys I use it all the time to blend my concealer if I'm not using a damp beauty blender like basically if I'm lazy to wet my beauty blender then I'm just going to use this brush okay so now we're going to use some makeup revolution setting powder oh my god I don't really use this powder but when you use the tiniest amount look like it softens your skin so nicely like it's so nice and it's set really good as well so this powder is bomb like look at that now i'm going to use the master bronze palette by maybelline again one of my favorite like products ever and i'm going to use the bronze shade and just apply this as a bronzer on the primer to my face and my cheeks you know i've got a big face so i need that definition then i'm going to use the blush shade on my cheeks and then i'm moving on to highlight and I'm just gonna pop this on the highest points of my face that's why I really like this um, like palette like it's so good for my skin tone and like I can just use all the products like all the colors in it and they blend so so nice honestly 
Now I'm just going to blend some of the eyeshadow under my eyes on my lower lash line and I'm using that dark shade from the palette and I'm also putting some Revolution mascara on my lower lashes. Then I'm going to take the Jouer lip, I don't even know what this is called but it's so nice and I don't know the shade but again we'll write it in the info box. I don't know how many times I've said that but it's alright but anyways this colour is so nice. I accidentally deleted the you know posy posy footage but that's okay I have what I have here because I actually did my hair nicely but I don't know it's okay but this will do right I thought this look would be really nice for Valentine's like this is my type of look and I love the lip with the eyes it's so like kind of natural and you guys know I've been like all for that more natural look lately but it's still kind of full beat on the skin and eyes you know anyways and the lip product smells nice, so it'll be good for Valentine's. Anyways, I'm going to stop rambling. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!